Jonathan Lee Riches Investigates. I am covering the Michael Vaughn case out of Fruitland, Idaho. I've been digging in really hard on Casey and Sarah Wandra. Casey and Sarah Wandra authorities are searching their, their property right now. They are neighbors of the Vaughns, live a few blocks away. Authorities have a lot of equipment and canine dogs and they're searching their property. That is Casey and Sarah Wandra. I'm going to show you a video right now. Uh, I got a lot of videos on Sarah Wandra and this video right here. I want you to look and watch this video and watch on her refrigerator. Look on her refrigerator during this video and also listen to what she has to say. Check it out. So I just want to tell you that, um, sorry, I'm really tired and I'm going to I've had no energy lately much, but God's bigger than your storm or your disease or whatever's going on. So I'm living proof of that because I'm diabetic and uh, my blood sugar, according to these things, have been almost consistently between like 300, sometimes even up to 600. Basically where the med modern medicine tells you that you're going to be in a coma, like, like or you should have already been in a coma. <laughs> Um, it's been like that for like years now. Still walking around, cleaning my house, praising Jesus. Barely taking my medicine that they gave me because I can't afford a bunch of new ones and there was a bunch of problems. But I decided to just trust God for it and yeah, still walking around. Got energy. Maybe not a lot, but I got energy, and God's given me my life. I'm not in a coma. I'm still here speaking the things of God. So, yeah. <laughs> Have faith in Jesus. I know my hair looks so crazy right now. I apologize if it is a distraction. Because <laughs> sometimes it distracts me, okay? But I just want you to know that Jesus has your back 100% with your health. I mean, according to modern medicine, I should be somewhere laying in a bed in a coma right now because, I mean, my blood sugar has been, my A1C has been almost 14 for like a couple of years now. That's like the max there is. <laughs> God is so much bigger. And I'm not saying that, you know, I'm, I try really hard to watch things. I'm not trying to do it all on purpose. It's not like I'm, like, eating sugar all day long. But I know that Jesus said that whatever we put in the body is not what makes us unclean. It's what comes out of the body. So just eat everything in faith. That's what I do. I eat everything in faith, even if, even if it's sugar. Okay, so you saw it. Michael Vaughn's flyer, missing flyer on her refrigerator, on Sarah's refrigerator, right there in the background. Authorities are searching her property right now. That's disturbing. That's very, very disturbing to see a flyer of a missing person on a possible suspect's refrigerator. <sighs> this world. Tough, tough world. Praying for Michael Vaughn's family, praying for the community of Fruitland. Hopefully, you know, they find something. And, you know, justice for Michael Vaughn. That's all I can say. Subscribe to my channel. I got a lot of videos on this Sarah Wandra and Casey Wandra, husband and wife. The reason searching their property. Everyone be safe. God bless.